To be able to solve this problem, we need to use the following property. If you have a circle with two chords that intersect with inside the circle, then the following relationship will hold. If you take the length of the two segments of one of the chords, if you take those lengths and multiply them, that is going to equal the product of the lengths of the two segments that create the other chord. Okay, so in this example, that means 8 times 15, because those are the lengths of the two segments that make this first chord, is going to equal 12 times x. So 120 equals 12x. And now all we need to do is use some simple algebra to be able to solve for x, so that means we divide both sides by 12. So that means 10 is equal to x. Now, since there's no unit of measure on the values within this um, circle here, then our final answer doesn't need a unit of measure either.